pyramids spotted on Ceres, mysterious lone mountain discovered towering over the surface of the dwarf planet. NASA scientists in California reveal images from the Dawn's spacecraft. One shows a mountain the size of Mount Blanc in a relatively flat area. The formation and origin of the mountain remains a mystery, and images of the bizarre bright spot on the surface were also shown. Thank you for watching the Shikama Live Show with your host, Shikama. The latest images of series taken by the Dawn spacecraft have captured a fascinating pyramid-shaped mountain on the surface. As the spacecraft gets closer, more and more features are beginning to reveal themselves. This includes the mysterious bright spots, which appear now as an array of dots scattered across the floor of a crater, but their source remains unknown. These images were taken by the Dawn spacecraft in its second mapping orbit from a hat height of 2,700 miles. Just six months ago, Ceres appeared as nothing more than a few pixels of light to dawn. Now it is nearing its closest orbit to the increasingly interesting dwarf planet. By December of this year, the spacecraft will be just 225 miles above the surface. Lower than the International Space Station is above the Earth. For now, scientists must make do with these tantalizing glimpses of the features that are waiting on the surface. In one new image, a pyramid-shaped peak is seen towering over the relatively flat surface. The mountain is peculiar, as there are few other features like it in the surrounding region, or even the rest of the dwarf planet. The structure is thought to rise above three miles, which is roughly the height of Mount Blanc in France and Italy, the highest mountain in the Alps. Another image reveals the bright spots in greater detail. Several can be seen next to the largest bright area, estimated to be six miles wide. Ice and salt are the leading theories for what is causing these odd reflectivity. Quote, it is exciting seeing these features come into sharp focus, Dr. Mark Raymond, Dawn's mission director and chief engineer, told Mail Online. Quote, a few months ago, when Dawn began observing a new home from afar, we called it a bright spot. As the explorer closed in and provided better views, we realized it was two bright spots. Now we see it is many. It's still not clear what is causing these strong reflections, and I think still more data are needed. Everyone has her or his own personal favorite theory, but the ultimate arbiter is nature. That is, we can all speculate and we can offer arguments, but the answer is going to be clear soon. My money is on the remnants from ice that has sublimated. The salts left behind then could be what's reflecting the light." End quote. Other images reveal the multitude of craters and lines strewn across the surface of this world located in the asteroid belt between Mars and Jupiter. There's also evidence for past activity in the surface, including flows, landslides, and collapsed natural resources, excuse me, structures. Ceres appears to have more remnants of activity than the protoplanet Vesta, which the Dawn spacecraft studied for 14 months in 2011 and 2012. Dawn, which arrived at Ceres on 6 March 2015, is the first spacecraft to orbit two separate bodies in the solar system. It will remain in its current orbit until 30 June before moving to a lower altitude of 900 miles by early August. According to NASA, several theories are currently being touted for what the mysterious bright white spots are on Ceres. The Hubble Space Telescope has found more than 10 on the surface, but Ceres has found that the two most prominent, Spot 5, are in a crater about 57 miles wide. One theory is that they are salt flats, that are reflecting sunlight left on the surface by salt water or by other chemical reactions. Another theory is that they are regions of ice, again reflecting sunlight. Ceres is thought to have 
plenty of ice beneath its surface, which could be exposed when an asteroid or comet strikes the surface. The fact that these bright spots are in a crater where such an impact occurred s supports this theory. Another possibility is that they are cryovolcanoes, volcanoes that are shooting out water or ice. However, the lack of raised area around the spots consistent with the volcano suggests this might not be correct, and they could even be water vapor ejection from a liquid reservoir under the ground. Although again, current observations, namely a lack of additional material near the spots, suggest this is not the case. Quote, the surface of Ceres has revealed many interesting and unique features, said Dr. Carol Raymond, Deputy Principal Investigator for the Dawn Mission, based at NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory in Pasadena, California. For example, icy moons in the outer solar system have craters with central pits, but on Ceres, central pits in large craters are much more common. These and other features will allow us to understand the inner structure of Ceres that we cannot sense directly. What do you think the spots are? Where do you think this pyramid came from? Answer below. Thank you for watching the Shikama Live Show.